James Walker Fannin. I am so interested to see what your opinions are about him. I usually begin my videos with my opinion. Then I like to use the facts about the person's life to prove my point, like an expository paper actually. Today I'm going to try to avoid giving any opinions. If you can catch me with one, I will give you a bonus homework point pass. So here we go. James Fannin was born in Georgia, January 1st, 1804. He was raised by his grandfather, James W. Walker. When James was 15, he entered the United States Military Academy at West Point. He did not study or go to his classes. He got into a duel with a classmate. Since duels were illegal, he was forced to quit school. After West Point, he decided he wanted to be a judge. However, he got into another duel, and this disqualified him from being a judge. He married Minerva Fort. They had two daughters together. In 1828, he moved to Columbia, Texas with his wife and daughters. He started a farm and started selling slaves to people in Texas. He fought in the Battle of Gonzales and the Siege of Bejar. After that, he was put in charge of the volunteer troops at Goliad. The fort in Goliad was called La Bahia. Many of the soldiers at Goliad complained about Fannin. One soldier wrote in a letter to his brother, I am sorry to say that the majority of the soldiers don't like Fannin. For what cause, I don't know, whether it is because they think he has not the interest of the country at heart, or that he wishes to become great without, without taking the proper steps to attain greatness. Now you know some of the facts. I can't wait to hear your opinions about him.